Armando Emilio Guibasa is a Mozambican politician who was president of Mozambique from 2005 to 2015. Career, Guibasa, born at Marupula in Nampula province, joined the Mozambique Liberation Front at the age of 20, shortly after it began Mozambique's War of Independence against Portugal. By the time independence was achieved in 1975, Guibaza had become an important general and leader in Frelimo. He became interior minister in the Samora Macal government and issued an order forcing most Portuguese residents to leave within 24 hours, known as the 2420 order because the residents in question were restricted to 20 kilograms of luggage. During the 1980s Guibaza developed an unpopular program known as Operation Production in which jobless people from urban areas were moved to rural areas in the northern part of the country. Following Mackel's 1986 death in a plane crash in South Africa, Guibaza, a member of Frelimo's Politburo, served briefly as part of a ten-member collective head of state. He was part of a committee investigating the circumstances of the crash, which came to no certain conclusion. He represented Frelimo at the peace negotiations with the Renamo guerrilla group that led to the Rome General Peace Accords, signed in Rome on October 4, 1992. During the transitional phase towards the first general elections in 1994, he represented the government of Mozambique in the Joint Supervision and Monitoring Commission, the highest implementing body of the General Peace Accords. Following the abandonment of socialist economic policies by President Joachim Cusano, which included the privatization of state companies, Guibaza became a successful and wealthy businessman, particularly in the construction, exports and fishing industries. He was chosen as Frelimo's presidential candidate in 2002 after a tough struggle within the party. He became secretary general of the party in the same year. President Guibaza was the candidate of Frelimo for the December 2004 presidential elections, in which he won with 63.7% of the vote. He became president of Mozambique on February 2, 2005 and was re-elected for a second five-year term of office on October 28, 2009. Guibaza is the first man to enter the Mozambican presidency with a non-Marxist party program and ideology. International observers to the elections criticized the fact that the National Electoral Commission did not conduct fair and transparent elections. They listed a range of shortcomings by the electoral authorities that benefited the ruling party a Euro Frelimo. Personal interests Armando Guibaza is one of the wealthiest individuals in Mozambique, which according to Marcelo Moss has earned the president the nickname Mr. Gu Business. He is a shareholder of Laurentina, Mozambique's second largest brewery, and one of the main shareholders in the Banco Mercantil de Investimentos. Equals eponyms equals Armando Emilio Guibaza Bridge, across the Zamizi River at Kawa. References External links, Office of the President